assalamu alaikum from the continuity of the last lecture cell wall inhibitor part 2 is cephalosporin cephalosporin classification is difficult to memorize so first we will memorize the cephalosporin classification as you can see cephalosporin first generation is cefazolin cefathin so precisely we can see that f a p h p h r a are the first generation cephalosporin with the exception of the c factor that is second generation cephalosporin now you can see in the third generation cephalosporin i m e o n e or 10 are in the third generation cephalosporin and with the exception of the cefurexamine that is the exception because it included in the second generation cephalosporin now fourth generation cephalosporin having the alphabets pi and the fifth generation cephalosporin having the alphabet rol that are the mnemonic and the identification of the cephalosporin cephalosporin are derived from the cefa Cephalosporin C obtained from the fungus Cephalosporium, and having the nucleus beta lactam ring, dihydrothiazine ring. It is the bactericidal and divided into the fourth generation on the basis of overall antibacterial spectrum and potency. Now it is the family reunion of the Cephalosporin, which includes the first or the prototype of the Cephalosporin family. so as you can see the first of the or the prototype of the first generation cephalosporin a cefazolin ansef and capsol are the brand name of the cefazolin second cefaclor is the prototype of the cephalosporin second generation and third cefotexamine and the cefepime are the third and the fourth generation prototype drugs of the cephalosporin when this family work you need to watch for anorexia nausea vomiting diarrhea and anaphylaxis reaction oral and the vaginal candidiasis may also occur first generation cephalosporin developed in the 1960 and it is highly active against the gram positive less against gram negative drug property cefazolin is a prototype as described previously and it's have the activity against the streptococci meningococci and as mentioned it have the half life of the 2 hours and used in the surgical prophylaxis next drug is cefalexin which is given orally and less active again h influenza penicillin a is produced streptococci and its half life is approx 60 minutes then the next drug is cefadroxil that have the good tissue penetration and more sustained action at the site of the infection or the at a, sorry at the site of the injection 12 hr dose ready use in the renal impairment patient when the creatinine clearance are less than 50 ml per minute next is second generation cephalosporin second generation cephalosporin are active against the gram negative organism but it does not have any activity against the p aeruginosa because here it is mentioned separately because p aeruginosa is also the gram negative organism then drug property cefurexamin resistant to the gram negative beta lactam is effective orally absorption incomplete activity in vivo hydrolysis and the release of the cefurexamine which is a prodrug c factor is the significant activity by oral rule oral route more active against the h influenza e coli and some anaerobes cefprozil good oral absorption which is greater than 90 degree activity against the strep pyrogen strep pneumonia as rs h influenza and as mentioned it is excreted by the kidney and having the half life of 1.3 hours and and having the indications bronchitis ent and skin infections third generation cephalosporin developed in 
activity against gram negative enterobacteriaceae and few pseudomonas and it is highly resistant to the beta lactamase special features not active on anaerobes deacetylated in the body meningitis hospital acquired infection septicemia septizoxime similar inhibit the beta fragilis and it is excreted by the kidney ceftriaxone is a most commonly used third generation or the most commonly used cephalosporin having the longer duration of action half life is about 8 hours crosses the csf elimination equally by y vial and urine bacterial meningitis it is used in the bacterial meningitis multi resistant typhoid fever uti abdominal sepsis and septicemia ceftazidine is used in pseudomonas aeruginosa infection pseudomonas aeruginosa mostly cause the infection in the eye or the ophthalmic infection it have the side effect neutropenia thrombocytopenia rise in blood urea fibrin neutropenia patient with hematological malignancy and burns cefepirazone strong activity on pseudomonas and as mentioned anaerobes and the microbes excreted in the bile severe urinary and the respiratory bilirally meningitis and septicemia next and the last is four generation cephalosporin distinctive features on non suspectability to the chromosomal beta lactamase cefepime develop in the 1990 highly resistant to the beta lactamase high affinity and broad spectrum high concentration in the csf excreted via kidney uses hospital acquired pneumonia febrile neutropenia bacteriemia and septicemia next here are the cephalosporin family with the indications first generation that is cephalax in sodium with the brand name caflex used in the severe infection respiratory gi gu endocarditis and meningitis second used in the septicemia lower respiratory infections bones infection joint infection skin and the uti infection third clefron which is used in lower respiratory bone joints infection meningitis gonorrhea and the last cefepime is used in the pneumonia urinary and gi infection this family is contraindicated for those allergic to the penicillin because it contain the beta lactam ring like in the penicillin and adr are anorexia hypersensitivity reactions and the gi pain so we should watch for these reactions it doesn't have activity against lame and what is the lame lame is the listeria atypical microbes like mycoplasm chlamydia mrsa and enterococci but it have a little exception that fifth generation cephalosporin are used in the treatment of the mrsa next the drug of the choice in penicillin it is the mnemonic of the penicillin pm pass list of an strict act of super fast trades pm pm is pneumococci meningococcal meningitis pass pestula multocida list list indicate the listeria and and indicate the anthrax strict strict indicates the streptococci act act indicate the actinomyces super fast which indicate the syphilis trains trench fever and t and small t is for tetanus thank you so much